Hey guys, I literally forgot how to talk to a camera. This is literally the longest break I've taken from YouTube literally ever. It's been over two months since I've posted. I don't know about you guys, but this summer has only been work. So I'm gonna use this video to kind of catch up with you guys, tell you what's been going on with my life, tell you a little bit about what the future is gonna be. And I just kind of want to take you guys along for my day. Today is a really fun work day and I'll explain later. I'll do a little get ready with me also and show you my outfit, all that stuff. But it feels weird. Like I forgot what it's like holding a camera again. Like my arm is tired. I already got my coffee. I'm also making a TikTok vlog today. It's kind of a content day today. So first things first, nothing's changed. Let's make a to-do list. I really have not made like any videos in this room. So this is really just like a big switch up. Let me turn my lights on. I have the same exact to-do list notebook that I've had for a really long time. I've literally gone through this whole notebook front and now I'm doing it all back. This is just my lucky to-do list notebook. Also, I don't know how long this video is gonna be. I kinda just wanna make it chill. This video might get three views for all I know. Like it's, my channel's dead. So it's time to, it's time to revive because we have a lot of exciting things coming up. Here's the thing, I kind of have like a lot to do. Everything I have to do just takes kind of a long time. I just don't have a lot of time because I have to meet my coworker at 3.15 and I have to leave here by three. We still have to give ourselves time to get ready too. So anyway, ideally I need to clean my room and put my clothes away, but that's not top of my priority list because I have some summer class assignments to get done. So I need to do that. It's my last week of summer classes, thank goodness. I also have a bunch of Poshmark items to list, whether that be today or tomorrow. It just depends on when I get done with my assignments. And then I work five to nine. Let's go ahead and start with some assignments. Just like seeing that this is the last week is so exciting. One of my assignments is a concert review though, which is good because I did just see Morgan Wallen. Why are my Western music appreciation assignments longer than my microeconomics assignments? This one is 127 questions. What? Cool. If I'm being completely honest, I just started watching my old videos. I haven't watched them in so long, but recording on YouTube again is making me like really miss like being a youtuber all right i'm taking a break finally because i'm getting very bored so i'm gonna go make myself some lunch because i've not had lunch yet check this out though i cleaned because basically my whole family except my sister is at the lake right now and the reason why i'm not at the lake right now is because i had work yesterday and i have work today but luckily for me i have all of next weekend off, which is like my last weekend home, but we're grinding this weekend. I've decided I'm gonna go ahead and start getting ready because I just don't wanna risk being short on time and I'll just finish up everything else I have to do before I leave, if I have time still. For my hair, I'm just gonna do some like wavy curls. It is finally time to start getting ready. Yeah, I still have schoolwork to do. I underestimated how long it takes to do my schoolwork, so I decided uh, I should put you guys on my good side. <laughs> Here's the thing. I broke my nail yesterday. It's broken, but I'm like trying not to break it more. These are my real nails too. So if this one breaks, then that's just gonna screw like all of them up. I'm trying to keep it on because a lot of people are gonna like see me with my hands today. Let me just like start doing some makeup. I have like a little bit of just like natural makeup on right now, but I'm just gonna go ahead and like <laughs> put a little over. It's basically just like bronzer and blush. So we're just gonna layer. This thing is literally awesome. It's the Pixi like bronzing stick. I just put it on before I do my makeup and it gives me some color and it just makes me way more glowy. I didn't even tell you guys like what my other job is. So during the week, I have a different job. It's like an actual 8.30 to 3.30 job and it's my like main source of income. But mostly on the weekends, um, sometimes it's weekdays too. I do Lala Links, which is a permanent jewelry company that I work for. It's literally where all my jewelry is from. 
that you see except my earrings but like my necklace bracelets and then i'm gonna put on some rings before i leave when i actually like get my outfit on and stuff it's literally such a fun job i've done it for about a year now i just started like a new crew basically a lot of our pop-ups are in like northwest arkansas which is my gym because i go to school at the university of arkansas so i'll be doing a lot of like arkansas pop-ups but they're actually based out of my hometown so it's really awesome because then when i go home i can work for them in my hometown but once i'm at school i'll be part of like the northwest arkansas team and all the pop-ups are at really cute places like yesterday we did a pop-up at, at like a plant room and so it was just like a cute little green greenery place just somewhere i would never go in unless i was working and then sometimes we'll go to coffee shops and then it's mainly like a lot of boutiques and then obviously when you're linking people you talk to them and then it's just a great way to know more people and I just like it a lot. I just used the Fit Me Concealer and Powder and now I'm going in with the NYX Bronzer. I usually use the Hoola Bronzer, but ever since I got this, I'm like, there's really no need to spend all that money on a bronzer when this one is like a dupe. When I was in Ulta last time, I just searched Hoola Bronzer dupes and this gives about the same thing I need to repurchase it this is in the shade medium bronzer is one of my favorite steps because i'm kind of a redhead and so i don't get super tan like everyone else does so i have literally been fake tanning this summer which is really embarrassing but i kind of have to because with my job i don't get to be outside and just tan all summer like this is probably the yeah this is definitely the summer where i've been to the pool the least i really only went like the first two weeks of summer when i didn't have work <laughs> and my summer classes hadn't started at that point i feel like during the summer i've kind of been going for more of a glowy look a glowy bronzy look i used to be a matte blush person and i would hate shimmery blushes ever since i've started that bronzing stick also before i go in with the bronzing stick i always use this but i didn't today because i didn't want to put it over makeup but it's the pixie rose radiance perfector anyway my next step is blush and this is the alomar cosmetics blush these are pretty like glowy so i just mix these two shades i'm going really in depth for actually no reason i should probably do like a whole routine for my eyebrows i've been using the anastasia brow freeze since this is out i've just been using this as like the i just kind of comb them up comb them down and then back up again it makes them stay more since i'm trying to look glowy bronzy i'm gonna use this it's a pixie just like eye stick then I'll just go in with bronzer to set it. I've been using this for far too long. They don't even sell it anymore. It's the Emerizy Highlighter by Anastasia. I don't know how I haven't hit pan on this yet because I use it all the time. Whatever, it's my favorite highlighter. It's just the perfect gold glowy highlighter. So I did that on my inner corners, brow bone, nose, cupid's bow, and this area. And for mascara, this literally hasn't changed in so long, but it's just the L'Oreal Lash Paradise Mascara. I wish my eyelashes actually stayed up like this. <laughs> right when I put on my mascara is really just when they look at their peak. And then they fall and I have to recurl them like five times before I leave. I don't really know if the camera is doing my makeup justice, but you can see that it's glowy, but it does last. Okay, I'm having a dilemma because I thought I knew the outfit I wanted to wear and then now I'm rethinking everything, of course. I don't know why I'm putting so much pressure on this outfit. Basically, the event, it's like an event. It's not just like a boutique or a coffee shop. It's like a summer bash at this wedding venue. And so there's going to be a bunch of vendors there. And then like it's an event that you have to like RSVP for. So I just feel like the outfit needs to be cute. I'm struggling to find an outfit. I feel like this one's very like... It's the Lala Lynx aesthetic. My tripod is literally like, <laughs> there's just a black and white outfit. It's like this, it's cute, it's simple. Um, the back is really cute. I, it's usually like a shirt that you wouldn't tuck, but I thought it was better from the front tucked. It's like open kind of, it's really flattering. It's just like the shirt that I wore today, but in black. With these black sandals, I look like an Oreo, but like in a cute way. And then I have like all my gold jewelry on. And then this one was my original plan. I just can't tell if I'm being swallowed by it or not. 
I don't know. I don't know. They're just like a little bit big. I don't know. It's cute and summery. It's like bright, but I just feel like I'm being swallowed, so I don't know. Which one am I gonna go with? Who knows? I need to leave. First, I'm going to get my drink that I just made. Oh, by the way, I did go with the yellow pants outfit. Um, okay, this is the drink that I just made. So delicious. It's it's like a citrus green tea with a hibiscus herbal tea. I don't know. I've been drinking it for the past like week and it's so good, but I just ran out of the herbal tea, so that's sad. But time to leave. It is so hot outside. I don't even know if this event is inside or outside. Also, I'm realizing I didn't ever tell you where my outfit is from. I actually don't even know where my top is from. Pants are from Nordstrom Rack. Don't know the brand of them. It's just really awesome. I'm doing really good here. My shoes, got them on Amazon for Prime Day. And then same with these glasses. I'll try to link them in my Amazon storefront. All my jewelry is from La La Links. Anyway, I gotta go.